analogy that I often use in my writings and stuff is a um, crazy homeless person out in the street doing their thing. And you sit back and you watch them and you say, um, you know, watching everybody avoid making eye contact with the man walking around him, trying to avoid him. And you, you have a moment of empathy and you say, you know, that was somebody's baby. Yeah. That's, that's somebody's son and brother and possibly father. And what got him to this point in life? But do you take the next step and say, come here, let me, let me take you to my home. You know, here's I'm going to adopt my, you. <laughs> here's the keys to my house. Let me get you a cab. You go to my house, get you something to eat, you know, get you a shower. No, because you know what would happen. The guy would destroy your place. He would enter into your world. It would become chaos. Then you'd have to get rid of this crazy homeless guy. Yet we do much the same in our interpersonal relationships. Men and women both do this where it's, I can oh, yeah. fix them. They, they bring a world of baggage with them. I can fix them. It's okay. And in fact, I, I see myself as being, and you mentioned it better than the next guy, because I put up with those things.